to talk about on the, on the internet about what a man looks for in a woman. Well, I wanted to come and just give you some insight on what a woman looks for in a man. Not too long ago at Kingdom Business Ministries, we did a survey and we asked the women, what do you look for in a man? So what I've done is compiled a list of the top 10 or so things that women look for in a man. Now, when I'm going to give these to you, they're not in any any specific order and they're definitely not in order of, import, of importance. But let's go ahead and, and, and get into it. Number one, the first thing that most women said is that they want the man to be the man. See, women don't want a wimpy, indecisive man. Well, there are some who want to control their man, but they have issues and we're not going to deal with them. But most women want the man to be the man, not controlling, not overbearing, but strong and confident. Number two, women want men to have integrity. Be a person, a man of your word. Don't say one thing and then do another. Because yes, we remember what you say. And believe it or not, we even remember the color of the shirt you had on when you said it. Okay, so we want you to uh, be a man of your word. Also, don't say one thing and then mean something else. We cannot read your mind. We, we, we expect that when you say something, that's exactly what you mean. So therefore, we take it to heart. Number three, be respectful. First of all, we want you to respect yourself, okay? First and foremost, please respect yourself. Take pride in what you wear and how you look. We don't want to be hanging off the arm of some bum-looking man. So we want you to take pride in yourself. Respect yourself. Then, respect us. Now, if you are in a relationship with me, then Pookie, Candace, and Stacy them, they ought to know it. And also, Jeff, Johnny, and Howard, your boys, they ought to know it too. They ought to know that I'm your girl, I'm your woman. They ought to know it. And so when we come, when they come around you, I ought to get the respect as your woman. Okay? So we want to have respect, be respectful. Number three, number four, excuse me. Treat me like the queen I am. Because understand, I am special. And... When we're together, a woman wants to know that she's the one and only. She wants to be treated like she's your queen. So, understand also that if you don't treat her special, someone else is more than happy to oblige. So, make sure that whatever you do, you let that woman know that she is your queen. Number five, men, we want you to be there. Be there for your woman. Be there physically, be there emotionally, and by all means, be there sexually. Just be there. See, women seek companionship. Now, you may work long hours because, you know, the money is good and, and you want to get that time in there, but your time with us is just as important. So, we want you to be there. We also want you to be there emotionally because... You may not understand what we're going through or what we're feeling, but try to, and then try to comfort us. Now, sexually, please, don't check out on us, okay? Don't check out on us and, and, and go into your fantasy world. Um, unless it's by mutual consent, understand, she's not Fifi, the damsel in distress, and you are not Conan the Barbarian, okay? So, be there with us, like I said, physically, emotionally, and sexually. Number six, most women want a man to understand we are not in competition with you. As a woman, I want you to respect my achievements and celebrate with me all of my accomplishments. We are in this thing together, especially if we are in a relationship. Now, just because I may advance quicker than you or uh, make more money than you do or have a bigger office than yours, it does not mean that I'm in competition with you. We're not in competition. But what it means is that I worked hard. I studied long and I prayed often to get where I am. So understand, 
I want you to be there with me, to celebrate with me my achievements, my accomplishments. I'm not in competition with you.